let's proceed to this. Different subsets using Venn diagram. So find the difference between A and B. So again, in here, we're going to use rectangle to represent the universal set and circles to represent the subsets. So we must have our universal set. Now, our set A has the elements 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. Notice that set B has the elements 1 and 2, which are also in A, and therefore, B is a subset of A. Now, how are we going to get the difference of it? So again, to get the difference, this will be the elements found in A, A only, without the elements in B. So you're going to remove the elements in B that is also in A. Now, how are you going to illustrate this? This. As you observe, we'll remove the elements from B that are also in A. Now, the elements inside the shaded region will be the difference of A and B. And what are those elements? That's correct. We have 3, 4, and 5. For number 2, find the difference between C and D. So we have our universal set. Our set C has the elements 6, 7, and 8. And our set D has the elements 8, 9, and 10. Dot this that 8 is also an element of D. And therefore, 8 will be the intersection. This is from what we have studied before about the intersection of sets. Now, how are we going to get the difference? So again, this will be the elements in C without the elements in D. So again, you're going to remove the elements in D that are also in C. Now, how are we going to illustrate this? So, as you observe, the shaded region will be the difference of sets. Now, what are the elements inside the shaded region? That's correct. We have 6 and 7 as the difference between C and D. For number 3, notice that the universal set is given. Our universal set has the following elements. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. Set F has the elements 4, 5, and 6. And set H has the elements 4, 5, 7, and 8. Notice that 4 and 5 will be the intersection. And notice also that 9 and 10 are not part of elements of F and H. It's in the universal set, but it is not in F and it's not in H. Now, how are we going to get the difference? So again, this will be the elements found in H because it is H minus F. So again, the elements in H without the elements in F that are also in H. And therefore, we'll have this. Now, what are the elements inside the shaded region? That's correct. So we have 7 and 8 as the difference of H and F. Now, why is it that 9 and 10 are not part of it? That's correct, because 9 and 10 is not are not included in set H. 